future stars are on display as minor league baseball comes your way on the show. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the Reno Aces and the Sacramento River Cats. We've got baseball on the show, and it's coming up next. Next to bat will be Nick Heath. He'll get us started in this one under the lights. Fouled away. 73 degrees our game time temperature here tonight and it probably won't get a whole lot cooler than that. And that's lifted the other way out to left. Dickerson comes in a few steps as he hauls it in for the first out. Next to hit Alec Thomas. The left field. Alec Thomas. The 1-1. One, one. And here's a ball hit in the air. McCarthy is back near the stands as he hauls it in for the second out. Next to dig in, Tristan English. First chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. English. And he fouls this one off. Two out, nobody on. Just off the end of the bat, it's a foul ball, and he'll stick around. Timing just to tick off there as this one's fouled off to the right. He'll try again, one, two. I don't blame the pitcher one bit for trying to get to chase right there. He's been fouling everything off. He's still got the entire arsenal open to him. So we'll see what pitch he comes with next. Throw the first with time to spare, and the side is retired. Now to the plate, Donovan Solano. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. One one is looked at for ball number two. Down the left field line and deep. And that will end up a foul ball. And good patience to hold back on the curveball in the dirt. It's full now, three and two. It's a fine line from working down in the zone on two and two and bouncing one in there that basically stands no chance at getting swung at. Right there, he basically spiked that one right into the dirt, and now he has to find the zone on a 3 2 pitch. He's set. Here comes the 1 1. Wanted to get the front door curveball on the inside corner there, but it backed up a little and stayed off the corner. High and deep down the left field line. And this will wind up a foul ball. Ah, uh, man, just a hair early on that one and just pulled it foul. It's going to have to find a way to refocus. Not easy to continue an A-B after you just went deep foul. Hit hard on the ground is short. He's got it. And there are two away now. So next to hit is Jason Bossler. First cuts for him here with the bases open and two away. The 3 1. And a good job there to lay off. It's ball four as he becomes their first base runner of the ball game now with two away. The catcher, Joey. Two balls and a strike. Here it is. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Back goes Calhoun. He can't get there, so the inning will continue. And not in time as the run scores. That is good. The second baseman, Peter. Standing in now, Peter Maris. And he misses two and one. Just off the inside part of the plate, it's three and one. 
well to me. It just looks like he's really aiming the ball a little bit right now. And it's funny, when you do that, you usually don't have as good a control as you do when you just let it go free and easy. On to first, and that'll do it as they manage to not let this inning get out of hand. Now into the box, Cole Calhoun. It'll lead it off against Johnny Cueto. The 3 2 pitch. Swing and a miss as he couldn't connect on the two seamer, and that's out number one. That Stepping in next, Jamie Ritchie. Jamie. One out, nobody on. Ritchie. never threatened the zone. It's gone full now to three and two. That hook stayed up in the zone. You can see he struggled with that curveball early. He's trying to find that release point with his off-speed pitches. Love to see if he can find the feel for that thing moving forward. Duggar is there. Two gone. Digging in will be Ildemaro Vargas. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. Cueto into his motion. Coming home with the 1-1 pitch. Breaking ball snaps in there for a called strike two. And that one got a piece of him. And now in the box, Drew Ellis. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. Drew Ellis. One and two now as that one's fouled off. From the belt, kicks and deals. Yanked on the ground down the line. And this will stay inside the third base bag. A fair ball. Vargas is on his way home. And a relay to the plate. And the tag too late as he's across to tie things at one. To the plate now, Geraldo Perdomo. Now a flare out to left center. Dickerson is there, makes the catch, and the side is retired. Bottom of the inning now, and digging in is the outfielder, Stephen Duggar. A 1 1. Waves and misses for strike number two. two strike. When I broke into the league, not many guys were throwing that elevated fastball with that much velocity on it. The game has changed. Pulled toward right center field. Calhoun moves to his right and puts this one away in the alley for out number one. So one out and nobody That's aboard. Tough. And into bat next, no it'll be Alex Dickerson. Alex Dickerson. Ready on one and two. And he squares up on this one. Deep to straightaway right. And that ball will stay fair. And it's gone. A home run. <laughs> Stepping in now, Joe McCarthy. Well, that and he just good. misses inside with the fastball there. Pretty good pitch right there. Fastball in off the plate. One of the things you want to do as a pitcher, try to stand those hitters up. Count full, three balls and two strikes. Now the three and two pitch. He swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. So here now is the pitcher, Johnny Cueto. Bases are empty here with two men out. Cueto. And it's fouled away. After fouling off the second one, I got to step out of the box, adjust my batting gloves, and tell myself there's no chance he's tripling up on that pitch. Scooped up. Over to first, and that retires the side. Ready now is number 25, 9, 1, and 2 do up. And he takes a cold strike, too. Swung on, and he went fishing in the dirt. And the throw is there to record the first out. 
Now, now back to the top of the lineup, the stepping in, Nick yeah. Heath. He flied Heath. out, leading off the ball game. Into the windup, here's the two and one pitch. Oh. Alec Thomas will be next. Into his motion, here comes the three and one. Hey. And it's up to a three two full count now. <laughs> This is hit pretty well out to left field. Dickerson's going back, but he won't get there as it lands just shy of the wall. And he is in at second base with a one-out double. Now batting, left fielder, Alec Thomas. Into the box now, Alec Thomas. Had to wait back on the changeup, and he did a good job just to make contact. Fastball swung on and missed as he just reared back there. Two away. Now at the plate, here is Tristan English trying here to plate the tying run from second. And this one's low here, so the count swells to three and one. And ooh, might have thought it was high, but it's a strike three and two now. Hey, usually the second time through the order, you start seeing an incorporation of some more off-speed stuff. But this guy's locating, feeling really good about his fastball. Two back-to-back. -back. Right fielder. And now a pitch hit sharply on the ground. But this will get foul. It's a ball and two strikes. One and two. Here it is. Two balls. Now two and two, two on, two out. This is one you have to make a pitch right here. The last thing you want to do is run the count full to three and two. Then the runners are going to be off to the races. Here's the two and two. Toward second. And the two out threat won't pay off. The inning is over. Bottom of the third now, and set to go is the third baseman, Donovan Solano. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. To two balls and two strikes now. I can't blame him one bit out on the mound. I'm shocked he didn't pick up the rosin bag and see if he could get a foul ball on that one. He had to see if he would swing way outside the zone. Three and two, full count. Line drive to left. But he'll hardly need to move out there in left as this is hauled in for the first out. No Striding in is Mauricio Dubon. He bounced out last time up. Here comes the one two. Hard hit ball to second. A diving effort here as he gets a glove on it. And not really much of a chance to recover there as he'll reach first on what undoubtedly will be scored as an infield single. At the plate, Jason Vossler. Started to go around there. Looked like he held up in time. No. Strike two, says the third base umpire. Now a curveball misses inside. Breaking ball. That's in the dirt as he takes a ball. Got to execute a good pitch right here. Runner at first is probably going to be on the move, and you got one of the better hitters on their team. Up the plate. And this misses for ball four. The second walk he surrendered here in the first three innings. He's set, and the 2 1 pitch. Hit hard on the ground towards second, and that's through into right field for a base hit. And he's going to score with ease as the throw will be too late. And now, Peter Maris. 
And this one's in the dirt. Good job to corral this quickly as the runners hold on. Now the 2-1 pitch. A bouncer up the middle. Fielded cleanly to second for one. On to first as they get the double play to get him out of the inning. All set for the start of the inning. And next to hit is the catcher, Jamie Ritchie. This is where the pressure starts to build a little bit on an offense. It's not late enough. I mean, you don't have to start panicking nope, right outside. now. But this is where you're looking for someone to light a spark to get back in this game. Hasn't seen a heater yet in this at bat. One might be coming right here. Hit high in the air down the right field line. McCarthy is over to his left as he snags this one for the first out of the inning. Digging in, the switch hitter, Hildemaro Vargas. And maybe a little extra motivation for him here after being hit by a pitch in his first at bat. And this ball runs away for ball two. Two and one. All even now, two and two. Three to one is our score here in inning number four. And that is swung on and missed. He's down on strikes. And the first two are retired here to begin inning number four. Now, batting. now with the plate is Drew, Drew Ellis. An Ellis. RBI double is what he was credited with his first time around. Damn. Pitch taken several inches below the zone, in fact. Changeup gets him out in front for strike two. Wow, what makes it so tough to be a hitter is to be able to hit and change his speeds, right? You're geared Four up count. for the fastball, and all of a sudden, he pulls the string and throws you the straight change, the dreaded equalizer. And this one misses inside a ball. He walked him, and they've got themselves a two-out base runner. Next to hit is Geraldo Perdomo. Flied out in his first at-bat, so make him 0 for 1 so far. And with his speed, he's one of those rare guys who you'd actually like to see keep. And he dives to make a spectacular catch. What a play there to end the inning. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. And that'll bring up the outfielder, Steven Duggar. Here's the one and one delivery. There's a swing and a ball lifted to left, but back in the seats, out of play. It's one and two. Pitch on the way. That's lifted the other way out to left. Thomas is there, and he has it for the out. So bases are empty with one gun. And into bat next will be Alex Dickerson. Well, Matt, you know he's got the timing on the fastball locked. In. That's what he got a hold of on that home run in the previous at bat. You do not come off the heater. Have to be leery of the off speed, but stay on the fastball. He's got to throw it again. Here comes the payoff pitch. Fastball too high. Ball four. And now here is Joe McCarthy struck out in his last trip to the plate. Sometimes you just got to tip your cap to the guy on the mound. He's getting paid to try and get you out as well. Anytime it gets up there, north of seven, eight pitch ABs, sometimes it just comes down to pure execution. Let's see if he makes the adjustment right here. Got him swinging on the fastball there. Joe McCarthy becomes out number two this inning. One ball, two strikes. A ball and two strikes. Now here's a fly ball. Well hit. Looking up is the left fielder. And this one is gone. A home run. Standing in now, Donovan Solano. To the left side, but it's well fouled. Two out, nobody on. back up the middle and there's his first base hit in this one so good work on a one and two count to get on base no batter number one shortstop at the plate now Mauricio Dubon one and two now as that's in there at the knees pulled high in the air out to left field 
He's under it, and that ends the inning. Dominic Fletcher will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher. Number 17, Dominic Fletcher. Lifted into the air out towards center field. Duggar is in his tracks now. One gone. So the batting order the turns over field, now and set gone. to go. Nick Heath, Nick. one for two with Heath. a double on his line thus far. The 1-1 one, one home. Misses for the two second ball. ball. It's a 5-1 game here in inning number five. Swing and a looper to left. In comes Dickerson. He can't get to it. This one's down. Now that left fielder, Alec Thomas. Stepping in now, Alec Thomas. Okay. Too high. Ball three. Defense has got to be on their toes right here. Three two count. Runner on first has got some serious wheels. You know he's probably being put in motion. Full count still. Set. Here's the three and two. Good swing, but a late one as it's fouled off to the left. Once again, a three two. And That's that out. misses ball four. ball four. So it's first and second now with only one away. Caleb Berger takes the mound to try to get out of this mess. There are two on with only one away. Tristan English will be his first assignment here as he'll face him with runners at first and second and one gone. In the dirt, goes to third with it, and he nails him at third. Great throw. Cold strike that time, and it's even at two and two. He'll be fine coming out of the bullpen in this one if he can keep the ball around the knees like that. Saws him off here as this ball's popped into the air. Throw cleanly into first, and that ends the inning. Riley Smith, a six foot one inch right hander, will be the one to get the call from the bullpen here. Number 46. So now into the box is Jason Vossler. It was a walk in his last trip. The one two. Yep, that ball went out. Half swing here, but it won't matter. It's strike three called anyway, and that's out number one. Now batting. Catcher. So bases are empty with Joey. one out now, and it'll bring Joey Bart up to bat. Yeah. One and two now as this catches the outer half. He's gone to the well with that pitch three times in a row. I'm interested to see if he changes it up right here. A swing and a miss for out number two, and a ball now he had no chance of making contact Peter. with. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Yeah, and if you get a guy flailing at a pitch like that, heck, you're going to go out there and throw that same pitch until he proves he can lay off of it. Into the windup. Here comes the 2-2 pitch. Line drive base hit. The center fielder. Number six, Steven. Into the box now, Duggar. Steven Duggar. Hard on the ground towards short. On to second out. for the force out, and the side is retired. Top half of the sixth about to get started, and standing in the outfielder, Cole Calhoun. Now a swing and a fly ball. Solano into foul territory. And this will wind up a foul ball. And that's taken high for a ball that's full now. Three and two. 
that was kind of a gift to the hitter. He's up there probably thinking of protecting on two and two, but when you launch a ball that high out of the strike zone, it's now obviously back. easy to take that one. Up in the zone for him, and he takes a cold strike two. Got to believe the pitcher's going to trust his defense right here. Look for something down in his zone to induce a ground ball double play. Tough curveball that time, but he's able to make a little contact to keep this at bat going. Here he comes again, one, two. Still a ball and two strikes. Tomorrow Vargas. He went down on strikes in his last at bat. We're in the sixth inning now of a five to one ball game. And that's into the corner of foul ball and right. Drill down the line. And this gets past him at third as it hugs the line. A fair ball. And now it'll kick around in the corner. And now he'll get into scoring position with two away. Now back. Third base. Drew Ellis. Into the box. Drew Ellis. We got two balls. And that misses right. two and one. Bullet back up the middle. And nothing will come of the two out double as the inning is over. Sixth inning now, and next it'll be the outfielder, Alex Dickerson. The one two. Two balls, two strikes. Ground ball sent back up the middle, reined in. Throws in time, and that's out number one. And now, Joe now McCarthy, 0 for 2 right for him to this point. Joe McCarthy. Down to three and it's up two. to a 3 2 full count now. In my opinion, one of the toughest pitches in the game to square up. Just a heavy sinker with good downward action. And he lost him here on 3 2 as that pitch misses. It's ball four. Down low, two balls and a strike. I'd be real surprised if he goes back out away there on the mound. This is a count for a fastball challenge, and we'll see if he's ready for it in the box. Even count, two balls and two strikes. The 2-2. Two -two. Takes this the other way to right, and that'll get down for a base hit. And that runner will hold up at second with two aboard now. In now, Donovan Solano. And he lays off for a ball, two and one. A time to start making some quality pitches. He finds himself in a tough spot behind an account with guys on base. And that's in there. Base hit. The throw to the plate. But this won't be in time as he's well safe and the run scores. No pattern. Number one. So now to the plate, Mauricio Dubon. Now a 58 foot curveball that misses for a ball. High in the air down the right field line. On the move is Calhoun. And that will end up a foul ball. And a half hearted attempt that time, but they'll say he broke the plane. And that's out number two. Now batting. First Up baseball. next, Jason Vossler. He struck out swinging in his last trip to the plate. 
sent on the ground out to second. Right to him. Throw to first He's in up. time. And the big inning is avoided as the side is retired. Savino Bracho is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Number 61. So stepping in is Geraldo Perdomo. He was robbed of a hit in his last at bat, so he'll try to change his fortunes here. Yeah, you got to control the controllables, Matty. All you can do is put barrel to baseball and see what happens. You cannot control the defensive wizardry on the other side. Two balls and a strike now. Now the 2 1. Pulls this one into the air out into right field. McCarthy is there to put it away for route number one. Jake Ladies Hager steps into the on deck circle now, looking to start something here with one gone in the inning. Number 16, Jake Hager. Full count here. Here comes the pitch. Now a swing and a miss. Maybe even a foul tip, but it's held onto behind the plate for out number two. Nick Heath. He's set. Here comes the 1 1. The count, 2 1. In there, 2 and 2. Bases are empty here with two men out. Fouled off. Another try at 2 2. Slider whiffed on for strike three. A great pitch to put an end to the inning. Matt Peacock will take over on the mound to start the bottom of the seventh. Number 47. Matt. Last half of the seventh here, and now it'll be the catcher, Joey Bart. The 1 1 home. Is swung on and missed for strike number two. One and two. That's a real nice location with that fastball up and in on the hands. Hard to do much with that because a hitter really can't extend his arms very easily. And that's the first down. So now here is Peter Maris. He steps in off a base hit in his last at bat. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Good fastball down around the knees there, taken for a strike. Hey, I still believe in my heart the best pitch is a well executed fastball down and away, and that's exactly what that is. He swings at that, that's off the end of the bat. That's not hard contact at all, and that's an easy out for the defense. Sent on the ground out to second, and that's the second out. Next, it'll be Steven Duggar. He could really use a knock here over three in the game so far. Now the three and two pitch. Liner towards second. And that's in there, so perhaps some life here with two men out. The tag, and they'll get him at second. And with that, the side is retired. At the plate, Alec Thomas, hard on the ground towards short. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up inning number eight. Now it'll be Tristan English. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. Here's the 1 1. Fastball close, but he didn't get it 2 and 1. Had a good cut there, but he can't time the breaking ball. That evens us at two and two. Not close with that one. It's way above the strike zone. Hit in the air out to center field. Duggar's there for it. Two down. Paul Calhoun will stand in now. No the hits to this point. Calhoun. 
two nope. and one. Hey, I hope Tails that Cole doesn't throw him off his game right here. He's been pitching one heck of a game, and I'd hate to see the umpire get in his head right now. Grounded up the first baseline, but this will wind up a foul ball. Two and two. Lifted the other way down the left field line. Dickerson on his horse, but this is going to wind up a foul ball. Looks at a fastball low here, and it's full. Three and two. And strike three called as he says, you got to be kidding me with the side retired. Bottom of inning number eight set to go, and that'll bring up the outfielder, Alex Dickerson. Now the three and two pitch. Back up the middle and in for a base hit. Now batting, right fielder, Joe. At the plate now, Joe McCarthy. Swung on, but fouled off to the left. Hey, last two pitches back to back, off speed, then he's laid on the fastball. He could pretty much do anything he wants right here on the mound. And another foul ball. Dickerson gets his lead at first, nobody out. That's a ball. Well off the plate with the change of pace, that's two ball two. Two strikes. And this is on the ground to short. Could be two. One there. On to first, but not in time as he beats it out. Mike Tuckman will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Number 29. Mike Tuckman. And he tried to hold up that time. We'll get an appeal down to third. And no swing. It's ball three. Set. Here's the three and two. Oh, this one bounces off the pitcher. Throw pulls the first baseman off the bag. So the next to bat will be Donovan Solano. On the night, he's two for four with a pair of singles. In the dirt here. And a nice job to keep the runners at bay as the count moves to two and two. From the belt, the pitch. Fouled away. He's got that certainly timed up now. I'd be shocked if the pitcher goes to the well three times in a row with off speed. And this is popped up near second base. Perdomo camps under it, and he's got it for route number two. Stepping up to the plate, Mauricio Dubon. He comes into this appearance in the midst of a one for four day. Even at a ball and a strike, here's the pitch. Outside, that's now a good slider that doesn't quite catch the zone. It's two and one now. He's got a couple of pitches to deal with right here, but he's starting to lose command of his pitches. It might be time to take a step back and try to refocus on making some good pitches. Go on to first, and they'll escape the danger created by the error. The inning is over. Tyler Chatwood comes on from the pen, hoping to finish this one off here in the top of the ninth. So striding in to start the ninth is Jamie Ritchie, and they could use a spark from him here. 1-1. And a swing and a miss. Good pitch there for the first out here in the ninth. Now back. Next Second up is Hildemaro Vargas. He doubled his last time through. Yeah, he did a great job to go down and get that nope, one his last at bat. But I got to think they're going to pitch him up, maybe elevate something in the zone. Now Interested back. to see how he approaches this next day, baby. Now the 2 1 pitch. 
Looked like he was cheating a heater right there. A little bit too far out in front. Got to find a way to keep his hands back. And he fouls this one off. Vargas, base runner at first with one out. And it's fouled away. Another 2-2 offering. Skied into straightaway right. McCarthy is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. Stepping in once again is Gerardo Perdomo. He comes to the plate as the last chance for his side. Two out here in the ninth. Now the 2 1 pitch. The count now at 2 and 2. And now those that have stuck it out tonight come to their feet. Fouled off. Fouled away. Good battle here. This will be the seventh pitch coming up. And he hey. takes ball three, so it's a full count now. Three, two, two out, runner on first. Lots of possible outcomes on this pitch. And a swing and a miss as they definitely had him reaching for that one, and this ball game is over. Hey, it always feels good to win a baseball game, but when you can win one at home in front of your home crowd, all those fans cheering, this is a good win for this team. And tonight's comes to a conclusion, 6-1 to one the final. The Rivercats took the lead in the second. Throw that until the very end. Caleb Barriger takes home the win. Number 25 was only able to work four innings as he takes the loss. So that's a wrap for us here tonight. For my partners in the booth, Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. And for more, click over to theshow.com. Fans, our final line score. First for the victorious Rivercats, six runs, 11 hits, no errors. They left nine runners on base. For the Aces, one run, four hits, one error. They left seven men on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and two minutes. Thank you for joining us here tonight. And we remind you to please Drive home safely.